What's up guys, Ankle Spangin here, and today we are playing as a motherfucking Runeglaive Nasus in the mid lane. And, I don't know if you guys even wanted to see this, but I tried it last game, it was actually a lot of fun. Um, it's kind of interesting, but still a lot of fun. AP Nasus was, uh, 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 yeah, yeah. I'll show you guys. I'll just have to sit back and show you guys. Because <laughs> I don't know how to explain it um, other than by showing you guys. But it was it was a great time, honestly. It's it's so much damage, but you don't... You aren't tanky. I know Keen or Kiane, whatever his name is, uh, likes to do Runeglaive Nasus with building tank stuff, which does make sense. But for the sake of the video, I think I will be going... Um, you know, like very full AP for you guys to kind of enjoy and laugh at and stuff. So, this is this is for you guys. Now, a couple things today, ladies. All I know is that today is Friday. Hopefully, you guys are having fantastic Friday, leading into an even better weekend. So, generally, you know, an 80 carry day. But I don't know. I was feeling NASA Smith. It seemed so much more fun. And I'll play an 80 carry for you guys tomorrow. Um, but <laughs> these AD carry videos have actually been getting almost, like, a slight struggle just due to the fact that there's not that many marksmen in the game. So I keep having to recycle them. Because it's either I recycle them or they're, I play, like, the two that I really hate playing. Um, but let's go ahead and get into this thing. It looks like we will be against an Anivia in the mid lane today. And I actually realized, like, at first when I was playing, I was like, I just, I want to I wanna clear waves, I want to do damage. And then it hit me, it was like, wait, that's kind of what I want to do, but what I want to actually do is just farm up and get like two or three items and just try and stack my Q as much as I can. Now I know, you know, I'm sitting here playing AP Nas, you don't need to stack your Q as badly, but obviously the more you can, the more damage you will do. Uh, I don't feel like it takes a genius to figure that one out. So let's go ahead and do that. Drop this E right there. Get a little paint off on her. And boop. Oh, miss that minion. Rip. Now, actually, CSing against the Nivea is going to be a little potentially awkward. Just because, like, a Nivea is a super good champion at zoning you off of your CS. But luckily, we have this smite here. So I'm just going to keep queuing as much as I can. It looks like first blood going to go down in the bot lane. So great job to those dudes and dudettes down there. Let's go ahead and... Drop the smite on this one, drop the... No! Alright, didn't get the Q off on that one, but I will get it on this one. Now let's go ahead and drop another point in our E here. I think I am just going to use my E to get that Siege Man and do some poke to this Anivia here. So, whoop, I'm going to take a little damage myself. Okay, I meant like half of my health. Um, that's <laughs> actually what I meant when I said a little damage, of, of course. You know, I, I couldn't have possibly meant actually just taking a little damage. That would be silly. So I'm actually just gonna fucking lose, like, my entire HP bar now. And whoop! Aha! There's her flash! So both of her summoners down. Let's go ahead and get out of here. Anivia, no sums. So what I was doing there was I was waiting for her, um... Her flash to go off before I flash, because I know that if I can get my flash off after she uses hers... Um, I don't plan on really fighting or doing much like that, so I'm not too worried about me getting ganked and dying. But, with Anivia, if Fizz comes along the line, and then just decides that he wants to fuck her shit up after I let her push, now that she's down a flash, that's actually advantageous for me. I know it sounds kind of funky, but trust me. Trust your boy, alright? Do you guys trust me? Oh, I need to get over here for this guy. Looks like we'll be bringing the booty down on him. That'll be the flash. He doesn't even need us. So Shaco, trying to jump our Fizz, will be getting a big old dick in his face. So great job, Fizz. Let's go ahead and push this wave out, because Shaco is dead. Anivia is gone. And there we go. Basically, like I said, guys, I am just going to be trying to farm my heart out. And then we'll be getting, let's see, we'll be going for the Rune Glaive, obviously. And then, you know, all that good stuff. I'm thinking... Actually, I'm not sure what I'm thinking. My mind is... Odd. But it's... What?! My sh freaking Spirit Fire doesn't kill those in one Spirit Fire yet? Rip. Alright. 
the dream. It's alive. It's alive on this spirit fire. So let's see. He did get a green ward. So he does have a green... He actually already changed the sweeping lens. Nice. So that'll be good for him. But it looks like... Oh, they're returning kills on bot lane. So I guess that's what they get for trying to fight. Um, after not backing. So it looks like they will both be going down. And let's just clear these waves. And keep chilling. Because there ain't nothing I'm going to be doing. The reason I got these double Doran's rings is for the sake of, you know, clearing waves and getting mana back all the time. Making it a lot easier for ourselves to, uh, you know, actually do this sustainably. And let's see, it looks like he wants to gank this Anivia. So I'm just going to make it look like I'm doing my usual thing. And let's just see here. Oh, that's going to be her going down for sure. Let's bring her into that egg form. See ya later, bitch! And even this little fizz, what a guy actually letting me get this kill off on her. Thank you very much. So that'll be a kill going off for us, putting us at 1-0 and 0 so far. And hello, Chaco. But we do have a thousand gold now, is a uh, decent amount, of course. So let's see, after these minions move up, I'm going to go ahead and just drop my E right there. Clear out that entire back line of minions. And, bloop, just keep it under the tower, make Anivia miss an entire another wave. So this is really good for us. And as you can see, I still don't even need to back yet. But instead of warding right here, I'm actually going to ward right there. This is a much better place to ward against Shaco, because now if he's going to try and gank me from anywhere on this side of the jungle, it's very likely that I'm going to see him on this ward. Um, the other routes that he can, you know, potentially take, whoops, I'm going to take some damage there, boop, but it's okay, it ain't no thing but a chicken wing, ain't no thing but an onion ring, but basically, like I said, chances are I'm going to see him from that ward, uh, if he tries to gank me, so, that's what we will be counting on, let's go ahead and just drop the nether, or another spirit fire under her butt, doing a ton of her HP just like that, Callista looks like she's getting to be a problem, which is kind of odd, considering bot lane was actually the ones to get first blood. So they must have really dropped the ball on that one. But it happens, so let's just weigh it out and... Uh, no! Uh, ah, fuck! Alright, so I was going to smite it in case I missed it, but then I didn't even react in time. So she's going to get her siege. I'm going to miss mine like a fucking failure. But so far we are a kill up and 17 CS, so this is good so far. Still try not to push too far forward, just clearing these waves and then backing off. Because I don't, I still don't want to do anything else. I just, just want to farm up and get myself out of here. So Anivia actually using much more mana than I am too to clear. And that's kind of funny to me. So let's see, she doesn't have any more health potions. I do, um, but I'm not super interested in using it. So not going to bother too much. She did just use her other mana potions. So all she has is her double Doran's rings and her amplifying tome. So Callista getting 4-0 now. Not sure what our teammates are doing down there. If you know, if the enemies are that fed, stop fighting them. Like, <laughs> I'm not, I'm not sure what these guys are doing down there. So I mean, hopefully they get this shit sorted out because getting a Callista really fed is not gonna be good. That's not gonna be good in the slightest. So hopefully Fizz can get down there, help him out a decent amount sometime soon. Looks like he is going for that Devourer Fizz build. A very interesting one indeed. And we're going to go ahead and just smite that Siege. Let's go ahead and queue this guy. Get that one. And then smite the Siege. And then auto. Miss that one. Fucking failure. And let's go ahead and just walk up here. Scare him off. And here we are. Just keeping ourselves chilling at bay. And I'm very, very okay with this lane. Honestly. I apologize that it's boring. I apologize that I can't viciously bark at her more. But... This is, like, best case scenario kind of shit. Um, for this type of Nasus to farm, is it's heaven. It's seriously god tier for me. So I'm just going to walk up here, work on this tower now, because I know Shaco's top, and I guess Anivia went back. So, let's go ahead and just wreck this some more. And so far, so good, too. We're at 60 stacks, and on this Nasus, that's actually not bad. Considering it's only 10 minutes in, we obviously we are behind where we should be but we're still not doing terribly so let's see here there's her stun let's go ahead and just clear this bonk 
and it looks like she wants to do a bunch of damage to me, but I don't really care for her to do that, so I'm just going to walk away. Um, there's not really <laughs> not really a whole lot she's truthfully going to do, so I'm just going to back off a little further. If she wants to interrupt my back, she's going to take damage, so that's <laughs> fine by me. But let's go ahead and go back here. Get the entire rune glaive just like that. So this is very good for us. We got the full rune glaive now. And even though we're going to miss a wave of CS, I don't even give a hoot, son. My Q is actually going to do a lot of damage now, and we should be very, very well off. Now, I might actually end up trying a different build this game just due to my own curiosity. Are they... Are they fighting again? Stop that. Stop it. Stop doing that. Okay, whatever. So I got both those minions and Nivea's bottom. My apologies for not calling that, but... What the heck. Alright, this bot lane is going to be a struggle, but let's go ahead and clear this out, clear this whole wave, and we'll get this mid tower for sure. I should be able to get some stacks off of this by just auto attacking it twice, and then Q, there we go. Go ahead and give me those sweet, sweet, delicious, delicious stacks. And, now it's a little iffy for me to be doing stuff. Wait, there's Shaco, he just used his, uh, whatever that is, his deceive. Now I have an idea. Alright, bear with me here, bear with me, I have an idea. So his red should be coming up very soon. Or did he already get it and it's already gone? Wait, is there going to be Damasian Justice? No, there is going to be Nasus Justice. And Justice for Nasus. Hello! Hello! Boom! Smacking him with it! And that's going to be a dead Nasus. Let's go ahead and work on this bitch. Drop that smite off on her. And throw an E under her buns right there. We don't know where Shaco is, but we don't even care. So let's go ahead and drop the ultimate. And walk away, because I'm starting to care a little bit. She did a lot more damage than I thought she was going to do. But let's see. It looks like... Wait. Yes. No. Fuck you. Dive this bitch. Kill her ass, boys! That's gonna be a dead bird! We having chicken for dinner tonight, ladies and gentlemen! So, Nivea going down from the Flash Wither, and the Earth going, oof, oof! Just gonna smack them all up, and we got Shaco right there in mid. I am safe to recall here, putting us at 2-0-1 with 94 CS so far, and... What? 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 Okay. Alright, let's get the Sorcerer Shoes and see if we can help bottom. Because a 5 0 2 Callista is not good. Um, granted, we have a good team to deal with her, but that's not good. That's that's not good for us. Um, and to be honest, at this point, I'm almost nervous to even try and help it. So let's just see if I can interrupt this dragon. We do have Shaco doing it. If I just waltz on over there, this could be good. So that's probably the clone. He did use his smite, so I could probably just point, walk in there with my own smite. Hello. Hello. Hey, damn it! Alright, whatever. Still gonna get one kill. Did not have my smite. Guys, there's a Callista here. Guys! Guys, I can't 1v1 her! Guys! Team! Team! Alright, that better be a fucking kill. Oh my... Oh my goodness. <sighs> well, I didn't get the dragon. I got one kill. And... Callista is just gonna walk out of there. So that should... Okay, I was going to say, that should at least be the blue for Fizz. But it's looking like they're going for this Callista. The ultimate will land! Callista's going to go down! Thank goodness something good happened in there. And let's go ahead and charge our booties back to mid lane. I will miss this wave, and that really sucks, actually. But it is A-OK. -okay. So let's see, what should I build this game? I'm feeling just tons and tons and tons of flat AP. That just sounds too fun. How, who who agrees with me there? Who agrees with me? Y'all agree with me? I bet you do. I can hear you agreeing with me, to be honest. So, let's just keep up the Q, keep up the very low amount of stacking, and keep up the CSing. Because the more, the merrier. And let's go ahead and kill one more wave's worth, and then we'll explore our possibilities. So I know Shaco's around here making this kind of an, uh, an awkward place to be, if you will. So I'm going to go ahead and smite that. Mm, bop. Bop that. And let's see. So if I just 
Wither Callista should be relatively easy kills on her. Uh, let's go ahead and just bop, bop, get some stackerinos off of that. And we should probably let Fizz kill this, actually. Never mind, he's not coming for it. I was going to say, if we let Fizz kill this, that's two stacks for his Devourer. So, that will be good for him. It looks like Janna is going to be going down again. Let's go ahead and jump in here, though. The ultimate going to land on Nami. There's the Wither coming at you. And boom, that's going to be smacking her. There's her flash. There's another flash. Going to be one kill right there. And we are going to chase this down. The bubble will not land on us. And kaboom, picking up the Spirit Fire kill. Smacking her in the ass. Just how I know you guys like it. And that will be another two kills going down for us in this bot lane. Well, not for us specifically, but our, our team, of course. So let's go ahead and drop the Q right here. I am going to just clear this whole wave because Anivia is most definitely going to be trying to take my tower. Um, and she will be succeeding in that endeavor. So I'm going to respond by taking this bot tower. Wow. Haha. <laughs> Amazing. So let's go ahead and kill this up. And schlonk. Smack it with the force of a thousand monkeys. Dogs. I'm a dog. I'm not a monkey. Fuck. All right. Let's go ahead and ping for Andy that she's up there. Hopefully he saw, I'm not sure he did, and if he didn't, well, this is awkward, because now he's getting ganked. So let's go ahead and run up here, looks like Andy duking it out, he doesn't even care that he's duking it out with him. Demotabra, gonna smack Andy down from the heavens, strike him to the floor, and that will be the end of his life. So rest in Andy's, and good night. So it looks like the Garen with the boots is a superior Garen right now. It is a shame, it is a shame indeed. So let's go ahead and just walk up here and E right in the middle of this wave, smack it all, kill all those mignons. And let's see what we can do here. It looks like Garen is taking the long way around. He did not get strick, strucken, struck, strucked, strucked. Yeah, we'll go with strucked. I like strucked. So let's see. Is he able to slow him down? I don't know. I don't know. All right, where's Shako? Oh, Shako. Oh, oh, Shako. All right, you know what? Slam jam. Everybody get up. It's time to slam now. We got a real jam going down. Welcome to the space jam. All right. I'm going to... Actually, I'm going to walk up this way because I don't know where Anivia is. So I'm just going to go ahead and, you know, wreck up on this tower. And there she is. There's the bitch. So let's go ahead and just waltz on out of here. I cannot afford the Rabadon's death cap. But I do know if she just ults and then ease me, I'm going to die. So, for the sake of avoiding that, let's grab some home guards and see if we can get something done bottom again. Because they're very far pushed. And, Callista really, she's just going off the wall right now. 7-2-2. Uh, two and two. We are 5-1-3 and three with actually decent CS ourselves. So we're definitely not doing bad. Oh god, that feels good. Oh god, yes. Oh, sweet Jesus, yes. All right, let's go ahead and auto that one. What? Okay. So it's official. My Q does no damage. I get it. Ugh. There we go. Smack it up. It looks like Janna's dying again, putting her at 0-6-3. Um, that's... Well, that's for obvious reasons not very good. Um, <clears throat> but let's see if Andy and I can do this. So, Andy leading the crusade here. There will be a Jack in the box going off and let's go ahead and just kill this I don't know if I really want to do this right now um, do we oh we totally do let's go ahead and go for this so will it be oh what the heck what the ba boom that's gonna be one kill coming out there stepping on the fire enjoy the roasting of the sushi and that will be another kill for us taking Nami out she should have just gotten out of there herself but I guess that's not what she wanted to do. So, she is going to find herself getting withered right there. Now let's go ahead and just drop this on her. Drop some pain off. Ba-boom! Smacking Damasi and Justice down from the heavens. The stun will not land, but this will. Come here, bitch! Wada! Smack her with the might of my thousand horses. And let's keep it going. And wada! Smack her plus six. Give me that. What are you doing? Oh, Damasi! Get Damasi to death. All right, let's go ahead and just wither him out, and come here. Come on, let's battle. One more? Uh-uh. 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 Oh, uh-uh. Hell no. Hell no. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. 
Come here, bitch! Fuck yeah! Another plus six! Putting us on that unstoppable streak! And let's go! Alright, and I'm gonna be taking her out, and I'm just gonna walk away. I don't want this anymore. I don't have mana, but I do have a fizz. So, if I can just walk my way over to this young fizz, that could be pretty good for us. So, boop! Smack it up, help him a little bit. Not gonna take it, though, because he does not have a sated devourer yet. And the dragon is five stacks. So, I would be a terrible person to just take that from him. So instead of doing that, I'm just going to not do that. But let's go ahead and just take what we got from all this so far. 8, 1, and 5. And we can actually go forward our entire death cap now. So 158 CS as well. Um, we have skyrocketed past Anivia's amount with over a 40 lead now. So that's very good for us. Let's go ahead and grab this thing. And then I'll be going right for the Luden's Echo, I believe. So wait, how much AP did I just get? I just got like 150 more. So that's not a bad deal. Putting us at 427 AP now. Pretty damn good. Up from, what were we, 240, 230? Something like that. Regardless, we're going to be doing a lot more damage. The, that's, the, that's the whole point of all of this. We're going to be doing a lot more. So just the impact of my E alone. Just 500. Hello, Chico. Where you going? I don't know where you're going. And I don't know where you've been. But I don't care. Let's go ahead and just kill all these guys. Boom! Kill that whole wave. Shaco going bottom. And Janna now 0, 8, and 7. Okay, I didn't even know she died for a seventh time, but apparently 8 is the better number now. So, oh, oh, man. Get out of here. Goodbye. Yeah, smack it up. Looks like we got a Nami over there. I don't want to do this. I really don't. Truthfully. Hmm, okay. Well, I guess I already killed it. Yeah, to be honest, I don't want to just, like, run into them. Because even though I do a shit ton of damage... I can't take a lot of damage. I cannot take much damage at all. So, it looks like Shaco is gone, though. So where are they? Hello! We got the bubble! Uh-oh! Oh my god! This is exactly what I meant! Okay, Callista is really strong. Alright. There, Callista is very strong. <laughs> I did not notice that. Wow. Or was that more Anivia's damage? Either way, I should be more careful, it seems. So I thought I'd be safe to get that wither. I was wrong. I was very, very wrong. So let's see. Maybe I should get like an Abyssal Scepter or something. It looks like Earth will kind of hit the Bork going off. And here it goes. Sated Fizz is actually not sated. Wait, is he? He is sated. So he's going to be poking him really hard. Will he get it, though? The Ghost is coming out. Dare, or not Darius, but Garen flashing away. Will not be getting away, though. So see you later, Garen. And let's go ahead and go back to mid. And that's actually a bit of a shame that I died like that. Because I was 8-1. and one. I just realized I gave him a lot of money to die there. So getting bursted, we're going to have to watch ourselves a lot more carefully. So kaboom! Just smack the whole wave gone. And just like that. Just like that. So, looks like Nami going down. Dragon is still not up for another 3 minutes, so we don't really have to uh, worry too much about that. Go ahead and drop this E, drop the smite... Drop another Q, and flonk. Let's see what we can do. Now, this is kind of an iffy tower push. And by iffy, I mean I'm probably going to bag off, like, right now. Un unless I j Fuck, I wanted to see how much damage I did to her. Because I, I, I missed. <laughs> so I can't. But let's see. We are 1,000 gold off our Luden's Echo, about 1,100. And that will be you know, another good breaking point for us, I suppose you could say. So let's go ahead and give this guy one good auto, one good E, just like, oh, look at that damage! One E, half of her health, holy shit! <laughs> Alright, I love it. So come here, you want some too? You want some too? Boom! Give her some of that, looks like, oh, the wither will land! And that will be, oh, that QSS flash out of the wither and fizz ult, saving her life with the QSS, or QS flash? QSS flash. Why did I miss an S there? It's like, it just didn't exist in my mind. Well, let's go ahead and smite that. Kill this whole wave. And blonk. Kill that. Shaco and Callista are going to be getting that Scuttle Crab. That's cool. That's cool, man. So let's see. Shaco actually doesn't have mana. So... There's his flash. <laughs> the things you can do when you know people don't have mana. So just kind of walking at him was enough for us to get his flash. Let's go ahead and clear this wave as well. Um, if there's anything this champion is good at, it is 100% clearing waves. Like, no doubt. 
So it looks like, uh-oh, Janna have to flash out of that and will be actually living this time. Not going to the 0 and 9, so that's good. That's good. Nami ultimate down, that is also good. So let's see. Hello. Boom! And get the wither off on it. Let's go ahead and drop the ignite. Or not the ignite, but the challenging smite. Bam! That's going to be one kill. Nami, you want to make it two, bitch? Double kill coming in. And that will be two kills for this Runeglaive Nass. It's putting us at 10, 2, and 5 with enough money for our Luden's Echo. And look at that damage so far. Looking good. Looking tasty. Boom! Give me that tower kill, boy. So that will be Callista not really able to handle... Uh, what we call the Young Wither. So, killing all that up. I'm going to go ahead and ping that. I'm on my way for this. Oh, shit. Looks like Tish going to be taking a lot of damage, but not enough. So, let's go ahead and just kill this. I don't know where Anivia is. Boink. There we go. All right. Oh, she's running that way. So, let's see. I don't know where she's going to go. Oh, there she is. So, but I don't really want to do that. That's way too iffy. Um... So is this dragon, honestly, but I guess we're committed. So, blue buff Nasus? I don't want to do this. I really don't want to do this. I think I think that's way too iffy. I'm way too scared to do that, dude. Way too scared. I'm going to clear this mid-wave instead. Because this is a lot of CS that I really uh, would love to have. Boop! Kill that. Look at all that. That was de fucking licious. Just so delicious, like... Go ahead and just eat that one up as well. It looks like they're going for that dragon. They're going to pull it out. And that's, I mean, it's the right thing to do. But let's go ahead and just shove this wave in a little harder. And clonk. Oh, it looks like Andy killing counter Andy. And Andy going in. Wait, they don't even have me and they're winning. Wait, are they winning? I don't know. But here comes Nessus. So. Dan it. Dan it. Dan it. Wait, wait, that's not how that was supposed to go. The one no, my Q missed! Holy Alright. Anivia's huge. I need MR. Wait, I have zero MR. No wonder she hurts me so bad. Alright. Well, take that to note, kids. Let's get ourselves an abyssal scepter. Um do I can get Spear of Visage? No. Wait. It gives CDR. Hmm. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> what are you doing there, Mr. Dragon? Come on. Those rocks can't taste that good. Silly dragon. You know what? Hmm. Hmm. This sounds too much fun. Too much fun to pass up. Alright, this Anivia is fucking huge, dude. I'm just going to avoid her. Never mind. I take it all back. Two of my three deaths have been from me totally underestimating this Anivia. That's really funny, actually. So let's go ahead and clear this top wave. I'm going to go clear... I'm going to clear this wave, and I'm going to get blue. And then we'll figure out what to do from there. But 608 AP so far. Uh, our Q should be hitting pretty damn hard. And... Shablonk! Well, my ultimate... Or my E hits pretty hard as well. Blonk! Oh, I can't even one-shot mains with my Q. Really? Pathetic. Boop. But I can one-shot those. Boop. Oh my goodness, I missed the siege. So Shaco going to be taking out this dragon. But that's not going to be, you know, the biggest of my concerns. To be honest, I'm pretty positive I can 1v1 anyone that isn't Anivia. And I think if I got the proper drop on her, I probably could 1v1 her. But for now, let's go ahead and get this top turret. 505 damage per Q right now. Look at all this damage. Kabloom! Let's go ahead. Fuck, there's an Anivia here! All right. Alright, just gonna have to fight her delicately, and treat it like a del- No, I'm dead! <laughs> Motherfucker, why is she up here? Alright, I was gonna try and fight her like a delicate flower, um, but you know, it's not happening. It ain't happening. So, she is 9, 3, and 6 now. I have over 100 CS on her, so I mean, that's good. We can, we can take our small victories where we got them, but the fact that her, you know, one combo of abilities will kill me right now, is a little alarming. Um, and by a little alarming, I mean that really sucks, actually. So, I mean, that's okay, I guess. But I really want to see, like... Fuck, dude. I don't want to have to get a lot of that mark. Man, I just want to get so much AP for you guys. But Nivea is getting to be such a problem. 
And she's actually like the only problem. Yeah, we really just need to kill her, then we win. So it looks like Garen gonna be going down. Will they get the Anivia though? So the slow coming out, and that will be the condemn to the wall, and Anivia gonna go down. Hello. Hello. Gonna drop the wither right here, throw this smite out, bop, and walk away. It looks like Callista gonna come out. Save me! Alright, there we go. I'm safe. Wait. And kaboom! There goes the kill! Smacking her up! Get out of my face, bitch! Taking your life! Just like that. I'm gonna go back real fast and home guard in. Home guard into Baron. So, if Andy goes to Baron, if Andy goes to Baron, if Andy, if Andy goes to Baron, we can get the Baron. So, Andy going to Baron. There we go. Callista is down, Anivia is still down, and those are the only two people we even have reason to be afraid of. And the smite for their team is in bot lane right now. So this is the freest Baron that you could ever have. So let's see. Can I get it, though? And... Wada! Not gonna be getting it, because I fucking suck, boys. My Q actually did no damage, and I forgot to uh, account for that. So come here. We got this wither off. See you later! That's gonna be Anivia... Or not the Anivia, but the, uh, the Nami. Oh, hello. Hello? Where'd you go? Ooh, ooh, ooh. I want it. I want it. I don't want it. I don't need it. I don't need it. Alright. So let's see. Oh, that's one Q. That's literally one Q. <laughs> so let's go ahead and just drop this spirit fire right there. Show them that we mean business. And there goes our heal coming out. This will be... Uh-oh. I just don't want to get hit up by her. Looks like he's going to be taking a lot of the damage. And this will be one... Oh, no! No, 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 no! Alt, 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 alt. Woo! Demacian Justice not going to be served. And my ultimate going to come out baiting his ass. Totally intentional base, by the way. I was never in any... F I never had any fear of dying right there. None whatsoever. So it looks like this inflibitor going to be going down. I don't know where Shako is. He's dead. And he killed his ass. So let's see what we can do. Wait, watch out for that. It's going to kill you. And kaboom! There goes a lot of her HP just with the spirit fire. She was like, oh shit, never mind. And I was like, yes, yeah, son, give me that ass. So let's see, can I get this blue buff? Can a boy get you blue buff? So, let's go ahead. Oh, a boy can get you blue buff. Hopefully. Whoop! Oh. Cool man. Right there. That's cool man. Yeah, I didn't want it anyway. Okay. Cool man. I guess that's cool. Yeah. Whatever. Cool. Cool man. Cool man. Me, me, me too. Alright. Well, I'm not gonna cry too much about it, even though I totally am. Um, let's go ahead and just chill on this. Kill all this. Boop! I don't think he understands how important CDR is for me right now. If I can get 10% off of that, man. And just spamming it, man! Whatever, it's okay. He doesn't need to understand. He'll understand when I carry his ass. So let's go ahead and go back again and sell our Doran's ring for another needless because I am going to be getting probably the Zonias um cuz fuck it I'm gonna go full AP for you guys I can't let you down like that but we got our Rylize now this will actually drop a big slow with our E now and that should be pretty fun honestly we'll see how this goes we got ourselves along with you know a bunch of more AP and the big slow we also got um you know some health so that'll be good. Flonk! Oh, I missed! Son of a bitch! Alright, so there's Shaco. There's Anivia. There's the one I'm scared of. Alright, I'm safe. So there's Shaco. It looks like he is going to be dropping himself right there. I missed! Damn. Alright, well, I know the real one's right over here. Hey, buddy! So let's go ahead and just see what we can do here. Looks like... Should I go for it? I don't know! Ba-boom! That's gonna be one bit of damage coming off on him! Fizz is actually dead! And... Whoop! Let's go ahead and drop this! That's gonna be the flash! Pop in the ultimate! That's a gonna be the ace! And ah, that's actually gonna be the end of the game. Hey, we did it! Let's go ahead and just BAM! Smack it all up! End of the game, ladies and gentlemen! Look at all of that damage coming at ya! Runeglaive Nasus with the supreme victory! 1157 damage hit on that Nexus! And a fantastic time indeed! So that young, sweet, delicious, hot, and tasty victory screen 
Look at that cute little kitten. Mm, love it. 16.5k gold, 291 CS. Look at the damage real fast. Ooh, keeping right up there. Uh, well, at the top of my team. Sorry, Andy. You can't out-damage this by 120. <laughs> Champion. But Nivea just went ham. She went off that game. So great job, Nivea. But could not carry her team. So here is you know the ending build. Had a lot of fun that game, actually. So, like I said, guys, ending builds, ending scores, ending gold, whatever you want to see, everything your little heart could desire. Here's my rank, because I know you guys get pissed whenever I don't show you. I got an S. Uh, if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you do leave a like and a favorite. It really helps me out. If you want to, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, or Twitch. All three links will be in the description below. And as always, I love you guys. We have a wonderful day. Peace!